what's up everybody i am lee or love lee whichever you want to call me and welcome back to my youtube channel i just broke my tripod y'all so i'm gonna have to be holding the camera weird i might put y'all on like my tall tall tripod but i mean that's just obnoxious because as y'all can see from the title i am going to be taking y'all on a tour of atlanta if you're new to my channel make sure you click the subscribe button if you've been here and been rocking with me for a while y'all know i love y'all and i appreciate y'all for being here as always let's get into it <laughs> This building is right across the street from the JR Crickets. It's kind of a staple. It's the pencil building that you always see in Atlanta photos or movies. Get some hand sanitizer. As the girl said, they don't even have people coming in to sit down in the restaurant. That's going to be the case with a lot of these places. It's not the normal vibe. But this is the food. Ooh, it looks so good. I can't even tell them how much I want. This is a lot of food, y'all. Now, oh, y'all can't see. Oh, let me get y'all right, man. Let me get y'all right. Okay, now, I'm gonna have to throw shade a little bit because there's a lot of times, and I'm just being honest. So I got wings, my wings, fried shrimp, and then my fries are up under here. I've had a lot of incidences where I tell people my order and I have to tell them three times and they still mess it up. Like I told him about this cocktail sauce and he repeated it and it's still on here. I definitely recommend y'all to try this. I'm literally only gonna go out because of y'all. So y'all need to get this video a thumbs up. Now we get into more condos and stuff like that, whatever got hard rock and that hard rock is just a dining area hooters the west end there's like a braves atlanta grill it's very pretty guys oops sorry okay guys this is the cnn building all of this stuff is really gated and covered up now because of the protests So that's the scene, but it's so crazy. Oh God, they got police officers out there. We're about to pull up on our basketball arena, which is the uh, State Farm Arena and the Mercedes Benz 
football and soccer stadium. Y'all can't see this, but it says Atlanta. Wow, y'all, look at that. So this is the Mercedes-Benz Stadium. All right, to the next spot. Sweet Lounge. They don't have no parking here, y'all, unless you're gonna valet. Bingo, easy peasy, nice and close. Oh, my mask about to fall off. I'm walking up to Sweet Lounge now. Like I say, you either gotta find street parking or valet or I think across the street, it's like some homeless people who'll be like, hey, hey, give me some money, I'll watch your car, whatever. That's up to you. I'll park on the street so I can come and go as I please. And that's like I got on hills or something like that. Got a lot going on, then I'll valet. Good. How y'all doing? Huh? You got to right here. Okay. He's going to take the temperature. Okay. You got to do a first check. So you sign that waiver. What's the waiver for? Um, he's saying that we're going to line up. You know what's going to be Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Well, I'm glad y'all doing all this. Now, usually this place is popping. Those booths over there is for like when you really want to dine, kind of do like a dining situation and eat real food. Of course, you can hang out on the bar. But when I came to this area over here, I was so shocked to see like the actual nightclub side. You see what it looked like. There's usually booths and it's like you can dance on that dance floor, but I mean, they're just using it as a storage for COVID. And upstairs, there's a whole outdoor patio area. Ordered me a little crown apple on the rocks. And as you can see, there's TVs everywhere and they have projectors. Thank you. Yeah, please, in the menu when you get a chance. Um, hey, Black. Uh, <laughs> I'm such an asshole. Um, anyways, oh god, look. Can a bitch just walk on the sidewalk in peace? No. <laughs> See, that's why you can't be going nowhere by yourself. Okay. Anyways, so a lot has changed. I feel like it's just so hard for y'all to get the real experience. I don't know when it's gonna go back to normal. Next stop, Pont City Market. Damn, y'all. Somebody braid fell out. Out here looking like a whole garden snake. So there's a food court. Do y'all wanna see that? I'ma show y'all, come on. There is this place called Skyview, I think, if you go up the stairs. There's like a slide and like in the winter there's a skating ring and all that type of stuff, so. But I'm sure it's closed right now. So it's very nice once you come inside. It's not like a mall food court. It's actually very cute for like a date night or something like that. But there are not really big franchises in here, so you're probably not going to recognize a lot of the restaurants in here. So, y'all see this? When you go upstairs, that's basically what it looks like. That's the slide I was telling you about. And there's like a bar up there. It's pretty cool. Ooh, that's an anthropology? Let's go in there. They be acting. They be acting real bullshit in here. Don't play with me, I could play that game. I will make you feel so small. You're going to have to reconsider. Anywho, one thing I love about this store is if you're looking for accent pieces for your house, like they have the most random but cute stuff in here. Like look at these doorknobs. You can add them to your dressers or whatever, and it's just a little extra touch to make your stuff pop. I'm just kidding. Da, da, da. 
Don't mind me. I'm just doing a little voiceover because it's probably music playing in the background. Okay, guys. So, Hot City Market gets so detailed. There's so much to do. And I will probably do like a date day one time and actually come through and show y'all a lot more. I just wanted to give y'all a brief overview because y'all have plenty to look at in this video, obviously. Like I was saying, in Pont City Market, there's so many things that you can do. I could walk around like the whole thing and give y'all like more details if y'all want in another video. But this is just a quick overview of what Atlanta has to offer. You can't really get the real experience of any place anywhere, but I'm just trying to give y'all a little bit of, you know, insight because some people are still traveling right now. Make sure y'all check out the description box because I'll have more videos of more detailed places of where you can go in Atlanta if you're legit trying to travel and figure out where to go. Look in the description box so you can see, I don't know, places to eat, clubs to go to. And if it's something that I didn't mention, just put it in the description box. I mean, put it in the comment section and then I'll respond or I'll do a video on it so you guys can know. I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here. It's so funny, like if you legit be going out in the world and vlogging, like people just be looking at you as, like you're so weird, but I'm not talking to myself. I'm talking to everybody who supports me, guys. Don't you understand? If you found yourself having a good time, you want to show some love and stay tuned for more videos, make sure, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Also hit that notification bell. That way you can be updated every single time I post a new video. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for being here. Also follow me on all my social media. X zero lovely. That's X the number zero. L-O-V-E-L-E-E. -E -E. Until next time, I will see you guys later.